In this Hampshire village in the year 1150, the curse of the Tichborns began. On her deathbed, Lady Mabel Tichborn told her family that unless each year on that day they give the villagers one gallon of flour, the house of Tichborn would crumble away. To this day, a Latin benediction marks the ceremony. Sir Anthony Doughty Tichborn, the 14th baronet, tells how the curse was only narrowly averted. This ancient custom has continued for the past 800 years with only one short break. This year, we feared that a second break might occur. But thanks to the courtesy of the Ministry of Food and to the great kindness shown by many, many people all over this land, coupons have been sent to us to enable the custom to go on. Once the dole was stopped, a generation of seven sons was followed by seven daughters and the manor house crumbled. Since then, the Tichborns have been more careful, and the curse is just a legend. <laughs> to every adult, one gallon of flour. To every child, half a gallon. That was the command of Lady Tichborn. <laughs> 5,000 BUs from all parts of the country were sent to Sir Anthony, so that the dole, ancient in custom, charitable in intent, should be continued. This is A. Curtis and this is W. Curtis. In country life and tradition, curses have a longer history than rationing. The wish of Lady Tichborne in 1150 is still a command to Sir Anthony Doughty Tichborne in 1947.